that. It was more tiring than fun, um, but it's great to end a game like this with, with a win. It was very close. Could have gone for either team. They are tough. They, they they understand the game. They play a great system. They move the ball very well. They had a, a good game, but we we competed. We we fought hard, and very um, proud of seeing, you know the. The way we we played and hustled and and stayed in the game. After you guys finished that three game road trip, you fell to ten on that three game losing streak, and now you won six straight. To take care of business at home. Yeah, um, unexpected to tell you the truth. Not that we, you're not optimistic, but the way we were playing, and we were a little demotivated, you know, demoralized uh, and a little down. And we knew that this six game uh, stretch was huge for us. Um, we got a little lucky with Golden State for sure, uh, but uh, after that we, we really competed against good, tough teams. I, I guess Orlando was the only non-playoff team; the rest were, were tough. So we put ourselves in a in a good position again, and now we just got to build from there. We just can't be satisfied because of this stretch. So got to go on the road and uh, and try to to keep improving. Did it feel you like the energy picked up for you guys this whole homestand? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, we, you, you can tell, it's easy to see that we competed really hard, that we supported each other. We, we got to a point after the road trip in which we felt like we, we touched bottom, that we really had to, to get it together, to support each other, to, to fight every possession, because if not, we were out. And, uh, you know, we, we found it, but it's not over. You know, still got nine games, I think. Mm -hmm. Uh, and we got to keep building, as I said. Before. Is that something you guys talked about after the road trip? I mean, got together and talked about on the plane or in the water? Or is it just kind of an unspoken? Yeah, no, no. We we talk all the time, especially down the stretch when you're in a tough position. So yeah, we we, we try to push each other. If somebody's down, somebody's not having a good game, we we're trying to to lift each other uh, because again, we we may not have another shot. So down the stretch, between 15 to 10 games left, we really got to. Uh, get it together. What can you say, say, about, what can you say about LaMarcus that hasn't already been said? This is amazing. What, what he did today. I mean, he was coming at a super high level. Um, probably it's hard to tell to say MVP type of level because of the way you know Harden, LeBron, uh, those guys are playing. But first NBA team or, or stuff like that. He was ridiculous, and the previous two games too. And he's carrying us. He's just saying, okay. Follow me, guys, and um, we'll be okay. First game, first half was ridiculous. He scored 28, and we all have one, two, and three <laughs> points. It was like just him playing against a whole team, so ridiculous. And besides, defensively, he was amazing too. Always in the right position. Um, super proud of the way he's competing and, uh, and performing. Is it fair to say the formula right now is hey, he's going to be our offense, and our defense is going to be there, and if both of them are clicking? Well, it's, it, that's the way it's been. Of course, there are some games in which the, the offense is going to flow great, and we're going to have open shots and and, trans and uh, fast break points. But when it gets to uh, play against a tough team, physical and it's hard to score, you know, it's going the ball is going to go through him. And uh, you know, he was 12 or 16 at halftime, so it, it's great. Sí, no, este partido nos puso en una muy buena situación. Eh, estos seis juegos de fila eh, nos hicieron sentir bien y poner bien en, la, en las tablas de posiciones. Así que hay que seguir, hay que seguir construyendo de ahora en más. I think it's both. Something that happens because of the way the team plays. I mean, we are not the most talented team in the league. Um, and he's the one that has the most resources to score uh, against one or sometimes two opponents. So um, he's the one creating leads. We we are not creating as much of pick and rolls as we used to in the past. Now we we, we need the ball to, to go through him, and he's been amazing.